After our last day at Lourdes, we were brought by our tour guide to the train station that will take us to Paris. Among the top choices for traveling from Lourdes to Paris is taking a fast and modern train. A high-speed train running between the cities were designed to offer the passengers everything they might need for a pleasant journey, including several travel classes to choose from. Fast travel time. The journey takes about 5 hours only. Fantastic onboard amenities are also at your service during the ride. The trains from Lourdes to Paris boast light and spacious carriages equipped with cushy seats and offer plenty of leg room. Big panoramic windows are perfect for admiring the spectacular views along the way. We arrived in Paris at 3 o'clock in the afternoon and we enjoy the rest of the afternoon visiting the must visit places of points of interest in Paris. Place do Pantheon is a square located in the Latin Quarter of Paris, France. It revolves around the iconic Pantheon building, creating a stunning backdrop for visitors. The grandeur of the Pantheon and the surrounding architecture makes it a popular landmark and gathering place. Surrounded by cafes and small shops, the square offers a charming and picturesque setting for both local and tourists to enjoy. Notre Dame Paris is the most famous of the Gothic cathedrals of the Middle Ages and is distinguished for its size, antiquity, and architectural interests. While Notre Dame Cathedral is undoubtedly one of the most renowned and emblematic examples of Gothic architecture, it is not the oldest cathedral in the world. The construction of Notre Dame de Paris took place between the 12th and 14th centuries, but there are several cathedrals worldwide that were built earlier. is the National Art Museum in Paris, France, and one of the most famous museums in the world. It is located in the right bank of the Seine River in the first arrondissement and home to some of the most 
canonical works of Western art, including the Mona Lisa, Venus de Milo, and Dream Victory. The museum is housed in the Louvre Palace, originally built in the late 12th to 13th century under Philip II. Remnants of the medieval Louvre fortress are visible in the basement of the museum. Due to urban expansion, the fortress eventually lost its defensive function, and in 1546, Francis I converted it into the primary residence of the French kings. The Museum of Louvre contains approximately 500,000 objects and displays 35,000 works of art in eight curatorial departments with more than 60,000 square meters. At any given point in time, approximately 38,000 objects from prehistory to the 21st century are being exhibited over an area of 72,000 square meters, making it the largest museum in the world. It receives 8.9 million visitors in 2023, 14% more than 2022. Place Vendôme is a public square which has a statue of Napoleon in its center, known for the glitzy jewel resorts that surround it. It was built on orders of King Louis XIV as a grandiose setting that would embody absolute power in the very heart of Paris.